Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another mod showcase. Today, we are going to be taking a look at Solstice Castle. Let me show you where it is on the map. So, Solst we are here right next to Rebel's Cairn, Broken, or to Broken Tower Redoubt, and Sundered Tower. With the closest town being Rorikstead and the close or the closest two towns being Rorikstead and Dragon's Bridge and the closest hold being Solitude. One's oh, hello wolf. I see you there. Anyways <clears throat> now I already tried recording this once before and unfortunately my game started to stutter like crazy. I don't know why, it just did. Because out of all of Skyrim Laz's homes, I think this is actually the most cluttered, in my opinion. The most compact out of all of them. Which I, I don't mind. I don't really care. But it's not really my ideal thing. Now... You have your apiary right here. You have a little view over the horizon with a wolf right there. Let's just leave him alone. Oh, yeah. See, see what I'm saying? Just, I'm going to try and take this as slow as I can. So you have a little place for your alchemical ingredients and a few fertile soils. Very, very cool. You have more fertile soil and a stable. You have plenty of guards warming the place. You have some bench areas where you can sit. You have a little your own black, black mist, blacksmith area. So a smelter, a blacksmith, a, a, blah, 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 a blacksmith. <clears throat> my God, my goodness, I cannot speak today. Blacksmith area. Let's just go with that. Um, you have a little pool area. Very, very cool. <clears throat> so let's go in here because this area is pretty big and then we'll go inside the main home sorry guys I I'm very tired <laughs> as you can tell I've been recording a lot come on in we got warm food All right. warm drinks and warm beds so you have a welcomed area now, I think this is actually bugged because I think there's supposed to be a, be a table underneath here, but you have, so we'll go from side to side and then we'll go up and down. So you have little area of bookshelves for the bookworms of Skyrim. Oops. You have over here you have a little enchanting area. So you have your enchanting area, your alchemy, your one. Let me do something real quick. Um, let me actually turn off the depth of field because I know that can be annoying to some people, but, <clears throat> but yeah, hopefully the depth of field will, what did, I just got a lag spike. Mm -hmm. So up here, you have a little seating. So this must be like the library, like the study area. So you have all sorts. You have bookshelves galore. Over here, you have like a little study area. And this is what I would assume is a classroom. Kind of like a bard's college, almost. Uh, 
then down here is okay so let's you have more tables a bar area you have a kitchen area it's through the vault we'll go there in a minute Then you have some follower beds or or, uh, or the beds for the people that stay here. Very cool. Let's go into the vault. Hmm. We have in here more follower beds. Very nice and cozy. Let's see what's in here. So, like I said, this is probably the more compact ones. One of Skyrim Laz's homes. Oh my goodness! So you have your shrines to the divines. You have. Torig's war, war horn. You have the right eye of the Falmer, Olava's to token. Very cool. And then in here, sweet mother of goodness. So you have a place to store Wuthrad. Grand Chambers. Uh, okay, so a big, huge open area. My goodness. this Is this going to be another one of the... Yep, 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 yep. So, yeah. <laughs> like most of Skyrim La La Laz's... Okay, so that leads to Solstice Castle. We're not going to go there. We're going to go through the front door because I want to actually... All right. So, you have your Dragon Priest... Busts, yeah, you know, the various different rings and weapons and stuff like that. So, what is in here? I'm very curious now. What in the heck? So, you have your, um, Jesus. Okay, so this must be like one of Skyrim Laz's bigger homes. Holy my god, man. Okay. Need something? Okay. My goodness. So you have a big, big ginormous pool. And what's up here? Okay, lie, lie, that leads to Solstice Castle. More beds. Yeah. I think that's it for everything in here. Yeah. Anything over here? Yes, there was. No! I'm going to side, side, side Solstice Castle. Go back inside the vault. Because I want to do this properly. Because so there's a couple play places that we can kind of... Yeah. Okay. I'm trying so hard not to um good to see you again, friend. Yes, good to see you too. Um I'm trying hard not to go like 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 turn my character really fast because that's when lag really happens. 
like when areas load in. Yeah, let's see like that, that right there. Oh, by the way, I totally forgot. Um, totally forgot. Come on. Stop lagging. Anyways. Um, so this is where you would have your um, uh, for sale sign. It's about 40,000 septums in order to get into the home. So totally forgot about that. <laughs> My goodness. I don't think I, I with, with an E&B and didn't do a lot. I don't think I could use this home. It's down here. Okay. So that leads into the vault. So let's go on the main floor. Let's see what's on the main floor. You have a little area you have your whole kitchen area. Like I you have kitchen area. Let's try and find <clears throat> So you have a whole pool area. We're not going to go in there because we just came in here in, from there. So there's really nothing on the main floor that's immediately evident to us. But I think all the goodies are upstairs. Yes. All the goodies are upstairs. Yeah, there's there, there's a lot to this. And oh my goodness. Have a, have a freaking throne in a council chamber. Jesus. <laughs> Honor to see you again, my Thane. Honor to you, my Thane. Apparently, it comes to your own Thane. Open door. Open sesamas. I'm just trying to... I'm not trying to, like, rush through this home, but I'm also not trying to stay in this home because... Out of all the homes that I've showcased with an EMB and with Dindulod, oh, seriously, I'm not, I'm, I, I, I don't know if you noticed, guys, but hey, where's, where's the bloody? Oh, here's the master bedroom. I say, I was like, where's the master bedroom? I didn't see it. Okay. Yeah, so you have your little areas, your little sleepy sleepies. Very cool, very awesome. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. I think that was it for um this area. Very cool. Let me just do a once over. No, I don't. What is out here? Curious. Oh, that's cool. A little, uh, little, um, spawn stuff. Jesus, Skyrim. You know, here's the thing. I know a lot of people complain about lag, but lag is what when you when when you like put an E and B on and everything, and especially on like consoles, like like it, it's bad, <laughs> you know. Unless you have a monster mothership of a computer to handle Skyrim, even still, you still get lag. But anyways, I'm just gonna sit my cute little butt butt on the throne. Um, but 
Yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I do apologize about the lag. I think this is one of those homes where if you were going to use it with an ENB and didn't do LOD, uh, just keep in mind that uh, you'll probably run into some stuttering. You'll probably run into some lag um, that probably, at least on my end, it was laggy. Um, of course, that's probably just because of the texture mods that I have installed. Um, but anyways, let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. Would you use this home? Would you not use this home? Would, do you love it? Do you hate it? <sighs> and if you did enjoy this, uh, uh, this video, like like and liking it and sharing it is very much appreciated and subscribe for more content like this and i will see you all in the next one have a fantastic day guys goodbye